After going through the comments of my previous video that discussed my thoughts on PVC3, I noticed a common suggestion popping up for PopCap to remaster the original Plants vs Zombies. Since this idea appeared so frequently, I thought it would be worth doing a video about. Obviously, a lot of this discussion will be hypothetical, and whilst in reality it is probably possible, but unlikely, at least at the moment. Let's say in an ideal world, PopCap see all our videos and feedback about PVC3, start listening to and talking to the community again and turn Plants vs Zombies 3 into the game we've dreamed of. Alternatively, let's say they realise they've made some huge errors with PVC 3, haven't got the resources to go back to the drawing board again and decide to cancel the project instead. If that was to happen, PopCap would probably have a couple of options, such as continuing to update Plants vs Zombies 2, revisiting previous games like Garden Warfare 2 or Plants vs Zombies Heroes, trying their luck with the PVZ match game, or starting on a completely new project. What may make more sense, however, is a remaster of the original Plants vs Zombies, where it all began. Just before we continue guys, I thought I would let you know about some new metal art prints that have been added to my merch store. I created these characters way back, but now they are available for sale. They would make a great Christmas gift. Yes, I did just say the C word. If my artwork isn't to your taste though, there's a lot of other t-shirts and merch you can get stuck into. Link is in the description. Anyway, back to the video. So, why exactly do I and many others think a Plants vs Zombie remaster would be a sensible option for PopCap? Well, we could say something silly like because PVZ1 is amazing, and that may be true, but let's dive into some more concrete reasons. Reasons that would benefit the studio both from a community and a business perspective. The original Plants vs Zombies released in 2009 was a genre-defining game. Developed by a small indie studio, PopCap Games, Plants vs Zombies was a wacky, deceivingly simple, yet very complex five-lane tower defense game. PVZ skyrocketed to global fame, selling millions upon millions of copies, and quickly became a beloved nostalgic title to both children and adults alike. Plants vs Zombies later got a console port which reworked a number of things and even added a new, very popular mode, versus mode. But let's not forget that was way back in 2011, 11 years ago, and therefore I think there's more than enough time justification for a remaster. Remasters have certainly become more popular in recent years with the likes of The Last of Us Part 1 already receiving two remasters within its nine year lifespan. We also have the undying Skyrim that has been remastered and re-released so many times we've lost count. But other than having a justifiable timeline for creating a remaster, what are the other more substantial reasons? Well, I think one of the core reasons for a PVZ1 remaster is about restoring reputation and winning back the fanbase. Since Project Hot Tub got cancelled, Battle for Neighbourville was released, and the 2019 Plants vs Zombies 3 got scrapped, it's been a pretty big downward spiral for the franchise. PopCap's interaction and acknowledgement of the fanbase is at an all-time low, teams have been scattered across multiple EA studios, and very questionable decisions have been made in both games and across the business. I'm not going to say that a Plants vs Zombies remaster would completely restore PVZ or PopCap to their former glory, but it would be a very good place to start, or restart. It would begin to rebuild that trust with the fanbase, it would create a positive opportunity for conversations and communication to begin again, and create a buzz for the franchise that has been sorely missed. Another very important reason that obviously makes sense from a business perspective is that a Plants vs Zombies remaster is almost guaranteed to sell incredibly well. It's probably one of the easiest ways to get money flowing into the studio. Remastering one of the greatest games of all time, that surely can't go wrong, right? They've literally already made the game, the template is already there. Like, I don't know any original PVZ fan who wouldn't purchase a remastered version of Plants vs Zombies at the drop of a hat. Honestly, if I was the decision maker, the managing director, or whoever at PopCap, I'd have probably already made this happen. I'm not going crazy, right? A remaster just makes so much sense in my mind from a customer-centric, community, future-proofing and monetary point of view. It would be a smart and relatively risk-free business idea in my mind. Plants vs Zombies isn't a very technically advanced game either, so it's not like PopCap would need a massive team or massive amounts of investment for this project. Another, albeit lesser important reason, but still worthy of note, is that a Plants vs Zombies remaster would be 
a great learning exercise for the studio. I don't know about you, at the moment I feel like the team at PopCap, well at least the PVC3 team, don't truly understand what made the first game so successful. With many devs leaving or being moved to other studios over the last few years, I imagine there's been a lot of replacements and new staff recruited. Potentially PopCap's devs may be relatively new to PVC nowadays. I realise this does sound quite condescending, but I don't mean it that way. I think it would just be a great project to revisit and pick apart and get to grips with why the original game was so successful in the first place. So those are a few reasons why I think remastering the original Plants vs Zombies is very viable, perhaps even very sensible given the current situation. But let's suppose PopCap didn't just remaster it, let's say they remade it and included some new extra spicy new content to sweeten the deal. Things like including content that exists on other versions of the game, take the console version for example. Why not have versus mode in the remaster, maybe go as far as giving it fully integrated cross-platform multiplayer? How about adding some additional or new mini-games, again like how the console version got heavy weapon? They could fresh out the Zombitar mode with new customization options or include some new wacky cheat codes. What about the addition of a fast forward feature like in PvZ2? Just quality of life changes I think that would benefit the modern gaming experience. Then a couple of things that I guess I would expect the remake to include like making the game natively 16 by 9 aspect ratio, they have already done this with the console version etc but I did want to mention it anyway, 4k resolution and 60 fps support, gotta have them silky smooth frames, and finally a full vision visual overhaul, not changing the art style obviously, it would just be updating the resolution quality, giving them a fresh coat of paint and maybe adding some additional new environmental animations. Overall I'm not going to kid myself and pretend that an original Plants vs Zombies remaster is on the table for PopCap at the moment, while the reasons I've given seem to make a lot of sense in my mind, not only to help the studio financially but also regain what has seemingly been lost over the last few years. In all honesty I think it is unlikely, only because I'm surprised they haven't done it already, there seems so many easy ways for PopCap to make revenue and win back the fanbase, yet nothing is happening. Why not add a new world to PvZ2? How about a new update to PvZ Heroes? Why not fix the boss hunt issue in Garden Warfare 2 or reopen the PvZ official merch store? There's lots of good ideas and quick wins just blaring at them in the face, yet at the moment we've got Plants vs Zombies Gardenscapes and PvZ Match being developed. I don't know, I guess I just think there's a lot more complications and issues at PopCap right now that we don't know about. In any case, I did enjoy exploring and talking about a Plants vs Zombies remaster, even if it is only a pipe dream, and let's be honest, with the way things are going, I wouldn't be surprised if a team of modders or fans create their own remaster of PvZ1 sometime in the future. But I think I've rambled for long enough, I'm really interested to hear what you guys think about a Plants vs Zombies remaster, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. But other than that, remember to hit those like and subscribe buttons, turn on notifications, and if you would like to support the channel further, check out my Patreon page by clicking on screen or through the link in the description. Okay, thanks guys. Bye. Bye.